Hey everyone, it's Owen here from uh, Changing Normal Podcast, and I thought I'd do a little quick video of what I've been working on this evening, which is a paddock for my pork. Uh, my pigs, it'll be out in the field this year, um, going to be doing a rotational grazing with them, and they needed some shelter out there, so I worked away at that tonight and built a little structure. I still haven't got the cover for it, but uh, most of it is done, so I thought I'd give you a little preview. So, you can see it's built out of expanded metal on the sides with steel tubing. And this is actually a bench top from a local greenhouse that I had on hand. And I, it's five feet wide, and I just ripped them in half. Uh, so they're two and a half feet high. And tech screwed on the corners uh, together. And then I built some of these corner brackets, tech screwed those in just to give it a little bit of rigidity and weld it up. Uh, these pieces of pipe that I had uh, for the, the roof, weld them on there and then weld them all along the uh, the sides so it's got a quite a bit of strength and rigidity uh, then added the boards just to help protect these top edges are pretty sharp uh, so it did two two things gives a, a top edge for the, the, the tarp I'm gonna use a tarp to cover this so I can take it off in the winter and there'll be no snow load um, which will help it last in our heavy snowfall winters so but it'll protect this sharp edge protect the tarp from that as well as it pulled the the tarp onto the uprights because when I cut them there's no longer any uh, anything to support that uh, welded a bar across the front to keep that together and this will be open in the field for them to go under and have some shelter um, the only other thing that I have yet to do is I will probably add some sort of wheel system that'll hold this up off the ground a little bit and allow it to roll easily down the field. I'm not sure if I'll make that a removable wheel setup or if that's going to be a permanent uh, set of wheels. That will be future project, but for now I'm pretty happy with getting everything uh, as far as I have. It's a beautiful day here. Almost 20 degrees today. Nice and cool. No bugs. It's the best time of year to be working outside in uh, in the Maritimes. You can see we've been busy here getting cleanup done from, from winter. And today was so nice. I started getting some lettuce and some white onions. And I think there's some other things planted there. I'm not sure what. Um, yeah, so that's the start on this garden. Uh, we've got three more gardens yet to, to, to do anything in, but still a little bit early. We're still going to get some frosts and things, so we have to only plant cold weather hardy things that don't mind a little bit of, a little bit of freezing temperatures and cold. Rhubarb starting to come up quite nicely. I'll have to excuse the mess in here because uh, still working on getting everything cleaned up. But we've got radishes and lettuce. And, right? Uh, yeah. I don't think there's any spinach in there. Maybe a little. I guess there's a little bit of spinach. A bunch more spinach over there. This is not. This is early weather, early crop stuff. We throw it in. We get a crop off of it before growing season starts, and then we. Uh, Clean it out and actually plant in these beds all kinds of little baby plants waiting for their turn to get in the ground. So yeah, that's that. Uh, all day. All in all, it's been a pretty good day. And uh, I'll catch you next time. Uh, give you another update.